Hello, my name is Amina and I'm your decision making specialist. Today, I want to talk to you about power. Yeah, not power over, not power under, not power through, a new kind of power. It's a power that you've always had. I'm sure you've used it more than you ever imagined. I'm simply going to give you a name for that power. The power name that I give it and that I'm offering is the human touch. Yeah, I don't mean the touch touch. I mean when you are totally with another person, with yourself, so that you are being the kind of leader that doesn't roar ahead and then complain because nobody's coming fast enough behind you, or somebody that you're just a leader that just pushes, come on, faster, faster, faster. You're not doing it right. Do it better. Not that kind of power. It's the power to be side by side with another person, to listen to that person, to learn from that person, and to lead that person with what you've learned. So that kind of power is the power to find the potential, the human part, and each of the people that you're with, at home, at work, everywhere in between. And once you see that potential, you don't nag them. That's that kind of power. You don't put them down because they're not living up to their potential. No. You watch. You kind of sneak around with that kind of power until you see something that they are proud of. You tap them on the shoulder. Tap them on the shoulder and you say, wow, you look as if you really worked hard on that. How does it feel to have that done? And then they will tell you and you will listen and you will have the power of knowing that you made this space, the time, the energy, you encouraged, you inspired, and you enjoy every bit of their success. Maybe it's not the way you would do it. Maybe it's not what you would do. Maybe it's not even how you would do. This is all about them in their circle, and you're outside of their circle, ready, willing, and able to be the kind of leader that uses their power with another human being. Because you know what? When that person is solidly in their circle, you don't have to tug, pull, push, motivate, anything. They'll be on their own and you will be having to run to catch up to them and their success. Use the power you have, the human touch, in a way that helps them be more who they are. Because the more they get to be who they are, guess what? The more they will let you know who they are. The more you know who they are, the less that you have to do. You can do less. They will do more. Everyone will be a rip-roaring success. All because you used your human touch. Try it. I'm sure you can find somebody around to try it on. Do it. 
all right, put human touch in your toolbox. Everything you do. The lovely thing about it is kind of like a spice, like salt and pepper. It'll go with everything. All right. Thanks for staying. Come back. I will be here. And remember, whatever you do, however you are and wherever you are going, be a leader. Always pack your human touch with you. All right. Thanks. Bye for now.